I bet she sure appreciates this. <clears throat> She's thinking, why can't it be this, this easy out in the wild? I might have just ended up spoiling a wild snake. <laughs> Almost down and gone. And as you can see, the hole up under the tongue, that's a windpipe called a gl gl the glutus. And what that does is it allows the snake to breathe while it's got large consumptions of prey in its mouth. A lot of people have asked me in the past, you know, how can they breathe when they got something bigger than their, than their head when they're actually taking it down? What's this, the glutus? Uh, it actually acts like as a windpipe, and they get their oxygen through that as they have a big, large mill in their mouth. So, it's, you know, it's pretty logic, plain and simple. Look like she's about to got this down. She's 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 a little bit underweight to my liking. She was out in my front yard the other day, real skinny as you can see for her age. Um, kind of help her out a little bit, get her beefed up a little bit before I relocate her, give her a little bit of head start. <clears throat> Looks like hibernation wouldn't too uh, much on her side when she got out. So uh, some snakes, that happens to some snakes, they come out of hibernation, they're not as lucky as the others when it comes to hunting. So she's a little underweight, so I'm going to help her out a little bit and give her a little boost and let her back out and relocate her. 